Hello YouTube. Today I'm going to give you just a little quick review on the WE SCAR. Uh, start off with the materials of the gun. The rear stock, very high quality nylon polymer plastic. Uh, it's adjustable, six positions on there. The cheek rest, also adjustable. The lower receiver is a plastic again, but a very high quality plastic, it's not going to break. Uh, apart from that, everything else on the gun is metal, all bar the hand grip which I've added and the dummy pet box. Uh, the rest of the gun is machined CNC aluminium. The adjustable rear sights, fully adjustable, metal, front sights, adjustable and metal, all the barrels, everything's metal basically. The only other little bits of plastic are the switches, I do, do believe they're plastic, a little bit there. Uh, to take down the gun, drop the magazine. Got a single pin here, push it from this side, being my side, pull the pin, lower receiver comes out. A little bit you've got to watch for on this is when you're firing it, there are some very small, I'll say Allen key wrench screws type things, depending on what country you're in, you can call them something else. They do work themselves loose from time to time on the fire select on both sides and on the mag release. They have come loose in the past on me, but luckily never lost the screws. Uh, yeah, just slap down the rear butt. Out comes the recoil spring, pull back. The bolt, pull out the pin, and then out come your bolt. It is fully ambidextrous, so you can change the charger handle from left to right. Let's put it back. There we go. Recall spring back in. Just hold it in and then slide on the butt again. That's the job done there. Push the pin in. It's as simple as that. Uh, pull back. We're in safe. Pull back. I think there's some gas in there. Single and full. There you have it. W.E. Scar.